So she goes through the metal detector, um, and she knows, she just walks right through and says hello to the Capitol Police officers. Go get it. Come on, get the ball. Sit. <laughs> you know, decided to make an Instagram account for her. I thought it would be fun to kind of document a day in the life of a dog on Capitol Hill. We try to take as many pictures as we can, and she's growing fast. When she started meeting senators, and Senator Toomey's a big fan. She like he likes Pippa. <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> I think a lot of people don't know how dog friendly the Senate is. She's definitely popular. Anytime we go out, it's like an ordeal. When she walks down the hall, people will come out to greet her because they hear her bells. Say hello. It's like the ice cream truck. <laughs> it is, yeah. yeah. Definitely bring treats. Exercise your dog before you come to work. Come on. more interested in the food. Pip likes to play in the hallway or go for a walk. Go get it, go get it. When we get into the office and then she'll take a nap um, so you can get work done. Hey, oh, she like likes okay. to steal pens, so. <laughs> I do need them. <laughs> I first found out that Capitol Hill was a dog friendly place when I was an intern actually here in Senator Toomey's office a couple years ago while I was in college. As things were starting to wrap up with grad school, I thought, what am I going to do with my free time? I love dogs. I miss my parents' dogs that I grew up with um, and thought that now that I have some more free time, a dog would be perfect. Yeah. There are probably like four other corgis in Russell too, so. Wow. She's met at least two of them. Just, she's cute. Yeah. <laughs> You're very friendly. Yeah. <laughs>